Good morning to everybody. We are back in the cockpit now in Tokyo, preparing our flight back to Zurich. Beautiful weather outside, still blue. Um, Daniel Riedeke, he will be the flying pilot out of Tokyo and uh, Cornel Brulisauer will do the landing in uh, Zurich. I will be the pilot monitoring uh, on this leg. Daniel, could you please um, sum up, uh, give a short briefing about our planning and routing? Sure. Good morning, everyone. Welcome uh, back to the cockpit. We're uh, looking forward to this flight. It's going to be a little bit of a challenge because it's a very long uh, flight time today of uh, 12 hours and a uh, little bit more than 40 minutes, which is more than block. So it's uh, going to be a challenge getting uh, in time or on time into Zurich. Routing is going to be a little bit more south than um, the way coming into uh, Tokyo. Leading us uh, over Khabarovsk, maybe you can uh, have a zoom into this, uh, Udo. The uh, planning airports that we're having today is uh, overhead uh, Khabarovsk. Then, uh, as you can see, uh, north of the Baikal Lake and uh, Bratsk, Surgut as uh, an intermediate air uh, airport. Then uh, Petersburg, Warsaw, and then uh, into Zurich. The weather en route is um, expected to be fine. Might be getting a little bit bumpy uh, out of um, out of Tokyo. Always a little bit over the Sea of Japan, and uh, thereafter a smooth flight. A little bit of a of a jet stream uh, over there that we're going to be uh, crossing, and uh, but thereafter into Zurich, also. No, uh, nothing special to be expe expected, but in Zurich, slight snow showers expected and uh, it might be clearing up, but that's going to be after our arrival in uh, Zurich. That's about it so far for the, for the routing, the flight time and uh, what we expect and uh, yeah. Maybe Oops, you I'm could sorry. give... Um, a short insight about the fuel planning. The fuel planning today is uh, we're expecting a takeoff weight of roughly 265, 266 tons, which is nine tons below maximum uh, takeoff weight. The fuel planning so far was uh, planning with the Zurich. We do have some additional time. Uh, planned in Zurich. We might have to uh, calculate it a few minutes of holding into Zurich because rush hour is beginning at the time we get there. Planning with Basel as an alternate and the final reserve. So that makes it 96 tons in total planning uh, today with a burn off of uh, roughly 88 tons. So it's uh, quite a bit that we're taking uh, with us. But should be enough the planning is already high speed as we're running a little bit uh, tight on schedule. Thank you very that's much, it. Daniel. Thank you. So that's it. Then uh, as soon as we're ready, we start with the um, crew at station. Huh? Is there anything to uh, mention from the flight uh, from Zurich to Tokyo? Did anything come in mind concerning our cooperation? Any imports? Okay, so we keep it the same way. Yes, Low intervention level, good cooperation while somebody's speaking with Udo, professional work, and um, good situation awareness en route as we did it uh, on the way uh, to Tokyo. That's it from my side. Perfect. Any Thank you. additional That's inputs? It. Very good. We are calculating our um, takeoff performance in which we have to uh, decide upon the runway news, which will be runway 3 for left today in Tokyo Narita, a runway with a length of 4,000 meters. And we just received our final load sheet, giving us a takeoff weight rounded up to about 267 tons. 
We have to do um, the atmospheric, to enter the atmospheric data, like the wind. I took uh, zero as we have light uh, headwind with an outside temperature of 4 degrees. A QNH of 1027. We expect the runway to be dry and we don't need any anti ice equipment today. And the takeoff center of gravity being above 26%, we will take off with the flaps 2 configuration and the air condition off. This gives us a calculation being um, runway length restricted. We have a stop margin on this runway of 488 meters. Our takeoff speed, decision speed B1 will be 142. We already inserted it in our flight management system, 142. Uh, rotation speed 156 and the minimum climb out speed which is V2 of 163. The clean speed calculated is 275 compared to the FMS calculation it is correct as a cross check and we'll take off with the flex takeoff thrust of 42 degrees that means we tell the system that our outside temperature is virtually 42 degrees. This gives a bit of a lower uh, takeoff thrust setting in order to uh, optimize our engine use. The engine out acceleration will be at 1700 feet. Here's some interesting figures. Our V2 V stall speed ratio is 1.22. We have a second second gradient of above 3 degrees and with a 10 minutes maximum uh, takeoff flex thrust will reach roughly uh, 3,000 feet. That's about our takeoff calculation. In the same time I um, already plan with a possible uh, contingency or a possible uh, problem after departure um, urging us to return to Tokyo so I choose again the runway 3 for left uh, I make an in-flight calculation with more or less the same factors zero wind 4 degrees 1027 runways dry no anti-ice. If we have to return uh, urgently, I take a landing weight of 265 tons, which of course is about uh, above 70 tons overweight, above the max landing weight. Then I already add an engine failure For instance, an engine 2 shutdown. With overweight, we have to land with air condition off. Normal approach type. With a gradient minimum of 2.7, we will land with uh, manual air thrust. And I will use full reverse and maximum braking. This gives us a um, valid calculation, a bit of factored landing distance of 2,692 meters. That gives us a stop margin above uh, 1,300 meters, which is performance-wise a good uh, situation. So that means in case we have to return quickly, we have a landing performance which allows us with overweight and an engine failure to land on 3-4 left uh, safely. Proceed to Hakami, which is 
Changing was about 800 tons. Okay, we are one way restricted. on the drive up. On runway 3, 4 left. Runway 3, 4 left, clear to take off, Swiss 1, 6 1. Ready? Time and fuel. Take off. Check start seven. Kono level run, fukume ato nankai no yotei desho ka level run. You have control. I have control. Manual flex forty two. SRS runway auto thrust blue. Check. Thrust set. Slightly right. Check. One hundred knots. Check. Positive climb. Gear up. Gear up. Check the seven contact DCA one one nine at this point. Yeah. One one nine. Navigation. Direct to the center, center back, near entrance, center 
Thrust, climb, climb, auto thrust. Check. Flaps one. Speed check. Flaps one. Flaps one. Checked. Seven thousand blue. Check. Changing was about 800. Okay, we are one way restricted. Let's run a dry run. On runway 3, 4 left. Runway 3, 4 left, clear to take off. Slice 1, 6, 1. Ready? Is he ready? Time and fuel. Take off. You have control. I have control. Manual flex focus. SRS runway on thrust blue. Check. Thrust set. Good afternoon, Swiss 161 Heavy, approaching 11,000 feet. 
Climb flight level 230, Swiss 161. Swiss 161 and clear direct to Malga. 